What is going on, guys? Dizzy Art here, and we're back playing some more Terraforma Punk 2. <laughs> That's right, guys. So, uh, yeah, it, it's a little nighttime outside, and as you guys can tell, we have some visitors. So, uh, I, I, I kind of wanted to show you guys a little something, something. So, remember those chairs we found over at that one house? Check it out, guys. <laughs> Check it out. So, yeah, you can actually capture these guys and set up like a really cheap little mob farm. So I have little chairs basically chilling everywhere. Like, look at this. I have a chair right here. So if we can get some zombies to come up here, I will show you guys how this works. But you guys basically saw exactly how it works. So, um, yeah, look, 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 real quick, real quick. So pretty much what happens is any mobs that come up here are going to try to come in here to get close to me, right? And then, buy them. That's literally all that happens to all of them. They just end up dying because they get caught in these chairs and then I, I can kill them. All kinds of easy. Yeah. <laughs> so watch here. This guy's going to come up. Hopefully. Oh, he doesn't have a sword. Never mind. All right. So they do that and then bam. So it's never the same thing. But just look at that. Super easy way to kill people. And level up all kinds. So yeah, I just want to show you guys that real quick. And um, since it is nighttime, I guess we could, we could do some stuff and I'll cover what we got going on over here. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that before we got going because it was nighttime and I was about to just sit here and wait and <laughs> wait. <laughs> so uh, let's cover some things, shall we? All right. So first of all, first of all, um, you guys already saw this stuff, right? I think. I think the barrels. Yeah, because you, you guys saw me get these guys right here, the little oak barrels. Well, if you place these guys down, you can go ahead and you can store stuff in them, right? So you can store all kinds of stuff in it. Yeah, you can. Okay, so you can store pretty much anything inside these. Right? No? Okay. Well, you can fit a lot of stuff in them. And then you can seal it up if you want. Right? Or you can just leave them out here and they collect rain. So whenever it rains, it'll collect you some water. So I'm going to go ahead and just plop that guy down. So as you can tell, I got all of these guys filled up with water. And then on this side, I actually have some more. Oh, no. These aren't... What? Oh, okay. <laughs> I could have sworn there were barrels. All right. Well, uh, they're not barrels. So... <laughs> Oh, should we should we get the other? Uh, nah, we'll just kill him like this. So this is what I've been doing in order to level up, and I've gotten some pretty cool loot just from doing this. It was it's been all kinds of simple. So pretty much I just wait here, and collect all the stuff, and then just let them pile up. On that side, it's even easier because they end up getting stuck on those chairs. So <laughs> yeah, if you guys want to set up a super easy uh, little baby easy way to get stuff mob farm, there you go. Just go ahead and do that. So let's go outside real quick and check if we have anything cool that they dropped. Which I, I highly doubt, but you never know. You never know. What's that? Ooh, a potato. <laughs> I don't really know if I want to eat that, but I'll, I'll take it. Why not? Oh, let me show you guys real quick. Okay, so another quick little update. Remember how we were trying to figure this out? Check this out. Bam. Yeah, so uh, one of you guys, uh, undeniable one, yeah, I'm looking at you, <laughs> told me about cornbread. I totally did not even know that that was a thing. Well, I mean, I knew that was a thing, but I totally forgot that that was a thing. <laughs> so, yeah, long story short, we now have bread. So I'm going to show you guys real quick how to make the bread, and then uh, we'll, we'll, we'll show you how to do a couple other things. So maybe we should do this. Yeah, okay. So we'll, we'll do the bread in two seconds, because I don't think we actually have any more... Uh, corn. I may have used it all. Yeah, I don't think we do. As you can tell, <laughs> I'm getting all geared up. I took all of you guys' little uh, suggestions. I made tons of these vessels. Um, I stored away all my food. I sealed it up. So now all my meat that isn't cooked yet, because I didn't know how to cook it properly, I just hid it in there, along with a piece of bread. So we're going to have some uh, fine, fine food over here. So if you just do that, you fill it up with whatever you want. In this case, I have some cooked fish, right? That is well done. Yeah, thank you very much. I have some cabbage, red peppers, carrots, and the bread. So, uh, yeah, we get ourselves a nice little sandwich. And if you look down here, hold control, and it tells you this is actually sweet and savory. <laughs> How amazing is that? So, uh, I think we're getting pretty good at this cooking stuff. Let's let's check our thing. So, cooking, um, okay, maybe not that well. <laughs> and then butchering, we're getting better at. Agriculture, we're getting better at. And uh, soon, we'll be getting pretty damn good at this stuff. So, um, yeah, I wanted to show you guys that. Let's see this. Uh, let's go ahead and go outside real quick. I'm going to need a branch for this. 
Now, does it work with spruce? This may work with spruce. I'm not quite sure. I know it works with oak or birch. I think it works with birch. Are you doing anything? How about are you? Are you doing anything? Oh, maybe we got to seal it. Oh, there we go. Okay, so bam. All right, so you do have to seal it. I'll just go ahead and take that guy out. Plop him away. Well, hello, hello. I'll just clear these guys out every couple of seconds because uh, XP and loot is always fun. Oh, there you go. Oh my jeebus. I just realized if you uh, hit them in the head, they die all kinds of fast. Did you guys notice that? The guy was like at a thousand. <laughs> and then he just died to like, what? Because this only kills you 185, right? And that guy just like dropped down all kinds. So uh, we got to start aiming for the head. What else do we get? Uh, we got a reward bag, basic one. So we'll throw that in here and then we'll, we'll, we'll see what we get. Because now we have four basic ones, one good one, and one greater one. So we'll do a little reward bag opening here in a bit. But uh, for now, for now, we'll, we'll, we'll go ahead and keep doing this. <laughs> all right, so you're going to need some tannin. So this takes about eight hours to cook up. And then once that cooks up, this is used in the actual tanning process. So in order to get this started, um, we're going to go ahead and grab ourselves some of this. And I think we need a knife, right? I have a knife. I have a knife. Nice little stone knife. And I think you just place that there. No, place it there. No, place it there. Really? It has to be one of the big knives? Oh, Jeebus. Barrel? Large. Oh, okay. Never mind. Never mind. I lied. <laughs> All right. So here, actually, let me see which ones we have the most of because these will give you three pieces each. So that's six right there. This will give you two. So that's 10. So let's do this instead. So we'll go ahead come out here. And then one of these empty ones, you just grab this, toss it in there and seal it away. Bam. So this is, at, I think that's how you do it. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, vessel. Lime water. Oh, okay. Let's unseal that bitch. So for lime water, I think you just need marble. Um, marble. And you place it in there. And you grab yourself a hammer. Where's my hammer? There we go. Let's see. Let's see if I'm all kinds of smart. Oh, that's flux. This is for, yep, mending. Okay, so how do I make lime water? Um, that part I don't remember. Lime water. Did it, did it actually show me? Damn it. <laughs> All right, here, let's see. Lime water? No, it's not gonna show me. Oh my jeebus. I was right. <laughs> okay, so apparently that is a thing. I I, I knew I, was, I might have been right. I mean, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. How the fuck do we just do that? Oh, it's not granite. Okay, so it needs, it has to be marble or a certain other type. Okay, so we need four damn, four damn bad boys. And then we'll just go ahead and place this. This does work with other ones. Um, I think, what was it? Mm, do, 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 do. I don't remember. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I don't remember which one it was. I knew we had marble. That was one of them, right? So here you go. So limestone, dolomite, chalk, marble, and borax. So you get yourself any of those with your hammer and uh, you should be good to go. Actually, I think, I think it needs two per thousand milliliters. I think it was, and we have 10,000. So two, how much is that? Boat. <laughs> I don't even know. All right. So I don't think it's enough though. I really don't think it's enough. It says it should consume it as soon as you have an enough in there. It'll, it'll turn it instantly into uh, whatever shit's called. All right, here, let's go. Let's go ahead and do 15 more. There we go. <laughs> the, oh, shit, son. Okay, so we need, we need more. Maybe we need um, another 10. Does 10 sound good? Four. Oh, oh, oh. And we'll place that there. Come on, that, that has to be enough. Is that enough? There we go. Lime, lime water? Yes, lime water. All right, so that was it. Okay, so now we got ourselves all kinds of lime water. We toss that guy in there. And then we seal this. Bam. Okay, so on November 2nd, we're going to get ourselves some medium soaked hides. So we'll let, we'll let that cook up. What day is it? I don't even know what day it is. It's uh, Dunk's birthday. 
Do you guys know that? <laughs> Who the fuck is Dunk? All right, well, uh, sure, we'll go with that. It's Dunk's birthday. All right, so it's gonna go from there. We're gonna slice it up into all kinds of pieces, and then we're gonna toss it inside one of these fresh bucket ones, seal it up, let it get all cleaned off, and then we'll toss it back inside here, and this will let it turn into leather. <laughs> now, this guy right here, the sugar cane, I was asking you guys why I couldn't eat it. Well, well, uh, apparently you gotta put sugar cane inside water, guys. Yeah, so for all those that didn't know that, there you go. All right, so we're gonna take off all the decay. Oh, really? <laughs> really though? <laughs> oh, I thought I was gonna be all smart and shit. Apparently not. Apparently not. What happened if we seal it? Oh, you get sugar. All right, well, fuck it. We'll just throw that in there. We'll get ourselves some sugar. I, I knew that this could have been a thing, but I just, yeah, I just didn't look it up. All right, so we're getting all kinds of sidetracked. We got that going now. So let's see, what, what other stuff can we do that I wanted to show you guys? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so I started sorting all of our shit out, right? And I put all of the little ingots and stuff in here. And because I've been on a mission to get myself um, a fucking saw, yeah, I kind of I kind of got carried away, and I wanted to test this out before I actually did it on camera. But what ended up happening was, see how I'm trying to right click this shit and it's not working. Yeah, I kind of tossed all of my copper stuff in here. You know what? Here, let, let's actually make some more vessels. We'll make some more vessels. And where's my clay? Give me some of this clay. Yeah, I, I kind of got carried away, guys. <laughs> oh, fuck. Fuck that one up. And I cooked it up, and then I ran off. And when I came back, the stuff had already cooled down. Because what ends up happening is if you put stuff inside the fire, uh, inside these little um, vessels, the clay vessels, uh, it cooks up whatever's inside there, right? And if you put your ores in there, it's going to melt down your ores into little... Little tiny melted little chingaderas. <laughs> That's as best as I can put it for you guys. It just basically cooks it down. And when you open them up, so let's just say I open this guy up, right? When you open it up, you can stick uh, little molds inside there. So you can put ceramic molds and get yourself ingots. Or you can stick whatever you want inside there. So in this case, a saw mold. And boom, you're good to go. So let me see. Yeah, okay. So put that down. And we'll grab ourselves some wood. So we'll grab that up. And then we'll just place. Oh, we need eight, don't we? Yes, we do. Oh, damn it. <laughs> damn it. Uh, we don't even have eight in there. Can we grab eight from there? Oh, we can. Oh, fuck it. Whatever. No, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> All right, so we'll place that in there. Are you fucking serious? Oh, my. Wait, did I just. What the fuck did I just do? You guys saw that, right? Okay, maybe I just took the wood out and put it back. I think that's what I did. Not quite sure, but we'll just go ahead and pretend that's what we did. All right, so let's... Yeah, it looks like it's good. All right, so I'm going to grab my little fire starter. I'm going to right-click this guy. Boom. Hey, what the fuck? Sir? All right, and we're going to let that cook up. Now, now, we're going to go to our little book, and we're going to cover the little... What are those called? The, qu the quests that we had already finished. Bam. All right. So I asked you guys last episode which one of these bad boys we should get, right? And like the huge, huge, huge majority of you guys <laughs> all came back and said, peach sapling, Dizzy. Get yourself a peach sapling because that's, that's the coolest looking one, most interesting looking one. And uh, yeah, everybody, everyone needs a peach tree, right? Except one of you guys. <laughs> yeah. So again, undeniable one. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you some uh, credit for this because uh, you mentioned that I should get myself an olive tree. And, uh, oh, oh shit, what's on fire? Okay, that guy's still on fire. He's doing good. He's, it's going to take eight hours for that guy to cook up. So don't don't worry, guys. Don't worry. We're, we're, we're in good hands. <laughs> if we don't starve to death or de get dehydrated to death. All right, bam. So anyways, so there's this little thing called um, a lamp, I think. Not this lamp, because you guys saw, we already have tons of these little fancy lamps. But apparently there's a lamp that we can make that requires us to have oil. So I don't know which lamp that is. Uh, probably this one, <laughs> the one that says platinum oil lamp, rose gold oil lamp, silver oil lamp, sterling oil lamp, and blue steel oil lamp. So I'm guessing it's these right here, right? 
And I these supposedly, yeah, okay, so it does. Look at that, 5,000 hours remaining. So if we get ourselves one of these, we can actually have fire for hours and hours and hours. That's So that I think that's gonna be pretty helpful, guys. So we're, we're probably gonna go with the oil lamp. Um, yeah, cause this arc furnace, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get an arc furnace for a while. Or myself one of those. So we'll, we'll just go ahead and uh, get ourselves this little guy right here Because with this you can press this down and we can get ourselves uh, some oil. Yeah, so um, We're probably gonna go with that I'm not gonna grab it yet until we find a new location to live at uh, because I don't want to lose it And I don't want to have to carry any more stuff, but if if you guys think that we should get the peach tree uh, instead of the oil one um, and we, we get a whole nother <laughs> unanimous decision then we'll go with the peach tree once we move into our new base but for now I, I think we're gonna end up going with the uh, olive tree for uh, the oil purposes <laughs> all right so we, we're probably gonna be able to get the copper thing going today uh, let's see survivalist survivalist what is this Ooh, reward bag really free reward bag I will take it all right how are we doing down there you're still going? All right, he's still going down there. And do you guys see those huge lags, like those lag spikes? I don't know what they're from. I'm assuming it's from um, some kind of like backup or something. I don't know though. If you guys know what that is, let me know because you guys seem to be pretty fucking smart. All right, <laughs> so covering the next thing, uh, I probably should have looked who wrote this. So here, l l let me give credit to where credit is due. All right. Couldn't find the comment, <laughs> but I know when you guys told me. Uh, pretty much the Meef, you can actually, uh, that's what it's called, right? Meef, yeah, okay. So this, you can put four of them in a block like this, and it gives you a quarter of a heart. So obviously, um, you get 16 of the Meef, and you get yourself a brand new heart. Cause you can't cook it down. All these that say smelting, you can't do that. I've tried it, I've tried it, bam. So well, now we got ourselves uh, nine remaining lives, which we're definitely gonna need because we keep dying. So, okay. And then I don't think I have anything else to cover. Oh yeah, um, these guys. I actually got like three or four of these brass leggings already. So um, yeah, that, we're, we're doing pretty good on as far as like protection goes because <laughs> I got these. And the next thing I'm thinking about doing is looting the shit out of this stuff because apparently this stuff can be smelted down. Look at this. So I can heat this up inside of a forge. I think it's a forge. So one of these bad boys, I can heat them up and I can get myself these little plates. Look at that. So those plates, um, actually you can use those to build other stuffs. <laughs> so here, let me show you guys. So we, we can actually smelt those down into brass, right? Look at that. So from the brass, you can make yourself, um, what, what can we make ourselves? <laughs> Cause I don't, I don't really know what we can use this for. So we can use that for springs. Um, I, oh, there you go. So all the, basically all of the brass stuff, this is what I was looking for, the ship crafting. So if we get brass, uh, if we smelt it down, we can make some of these spy glasses, turbines, little tinkers, goggles, which we already have, I think. Yeah. They just. We haven't used them. <laughs> uh, wrenches. You can basically get all kinds of stuff. A rocket launcher. Really? Really though? <laughs> so yeah, it's going to be all kinds of helpful. Um, especially like with this stuff. We have a lot of this stuff. Like a steam drill. We have that guy. And these aren't broken guys. Like these still work. Um, you just basically need steam to power them up. Which we don't have. Um, because I figured out... You guys know how we had this at like 5,000, I think. Yeah, it was. I think it was at 5,000. And I was using it and I kept being able to use it, right? So like if I want to break this down, I could sit here for a really long time and it'll eventually break it, which is how I've been breaking a lot of the stuff. But if you were to, if like if this had the little steam thing inside of it, you can go up, to, you can, right before you hit it, you just right click a bunch of times and it like powers it up, like it winds it up. And then when you use it, it powers like a regular tool but I did waste it all. <laughs> so now we're, we're down to freaking having to do this. If we want, if we like really, really need to break something. But for the most part, I've just been leaving this shit alone. Cause I was like, I don't think, I think you guys understand that I can build a little bit better than this, right? <laughs> for those of you guys that are new to my channel, this is not how we build houses or anything. This is basically like, I'm trying to be super stingy not build anything and not waste my materials which is why i'm using logs as walls and 
tables as floors and storage. So yeah, like if I want, I can put that there, bam. So now I have floor that I can actually place all my tools on. How cool is that? <laughs> so yeah, just stupid little things that have been helping me out. Like I literally, wh what's a door doing there? But, well, if I put it inside there, it takes up space because we don't have a, a song. Oh shit. I just realized this is out. Damn it. Damn it to hell. Oh shit. Okay, let's see if, let's see if we did it right. Nope. That's empty. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, so copper 75 units. Uh, oh, oh, hold on. Oh, you're, you're gonna sit? Okay, sit right there. Sit tight, buddy. Just sit tight. Hold on. <laughs> Let's lower this, because it's gonna be all kinds of annoying. Okay, so now, now, ladies and gentlemen, we have 75 units of copper in there. So, if I, if I did this correctly, I should be able to toss it in there. Oh, shit, son. Oh, shit, son. What? No! Oh my Ejibus. Do we really not have enough? I think we may have just fucked it up, guys. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> that was all the copper I had. <laughs> I think. This may, this may be copper in here somewhere. I just may not know what it is, so uh, I'm not gonna look like a total jackass. Let me let me figure out what all this stuff is if I can actually use it as copper. All right, be right back. All right, fuck it. I don't even care. <laughs> I'm gonna use this, the bismuthite, because that gives you the bismuth, right? That stuff. So we're we're gonna go with that. Fuck it. I don't care. Um, I know that's super useful, but that's the only one that I have a lot of. And for now. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of screwed, guys. Kind of screwed. I don't know if that's going to be useful at all anymore, but I want that guy. Give me your sword, sir. Give me your fucking sword. Did you drop it? Please tell me you dropped it. I can't tell. Ah, all right, fuck it. Here, we're going to kill these guys. Come on, tell me you guys have a better way of farming these guys. I mean, um, I, I do have some pretty cool ideas as far as farms that I'm going to be setting up. But for now, I think we're just going to do some stupid stuff. Oh, wait. I'll get back here. All right. Is, is we good? Is we good? All right. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, we'll, we'll, we'll go ahead and collect all of our cool stuff. Do, is that it? All right. So, we have some ectoplasm. I think we just got a brass sheet. Did we? Oh, we did. We got another bra big brass sheet. Which is super helpful, because uh, that means... You know what? We could actually make brass stuff. Now that I think about it, we have a lot of brass. Look at that. Four brass sheets. How much is that if I smelt it down? Because <laughs> that's, that's basically what I need. So each one gives me two sheets, right? Okay, we're going we're gonna to have to think about this for a second. Let's be smart here, guys. All right, l l let me think about this, and then we'll be right back. Guys, I don't know if you guys realize this. Look at my inventory and tell me what you guys see right next to this sawmill that is filled with copperness. Bam! <laughs> so we have nine copper ingots that have been sitting there. Now, I don't know if this will work um, to stick it inside one of the little things, but we're gonna try it. We're gonna pop that guy in there. Gonna place him in there. I'm um, kind of scared, but. Whatevs. <laughs> gonna throw that guy in there. Gonna place him down. Um, and then our brass sheets. I just want to see what happens when we when we toss these. Oh, you can't. You can't put them in there. Okay, so we can't cook it up in there. So that is a no-no. Uh, everything else should be good to go. So we're about to waste some more stuff, probably. Oh, you know what? Here. Uh, can we not? Wait, hold on. Can we? Can we do this? I'm trying to think. Um, what else would be good? Uh, I don't... Well, I can't really use that, but here, let's do this. We'll just do two more of these guys, because we're going to have more room for it, so... It's okay. It's okay. We can we can waste all kinds. Alright, so put that back inside here. Can we... Yeah, we can. Alright, sweet. Alright, so I'm going to place that guy. Is that... Hold on. Is that mine? Or did I just find another one? No, it's mine. Whew. I was like, what? Oh, we're smelting that one down. <laughs> you guys like how I don't even, I don't even care. I'm like, oh, smelt that shit down. Oh, smelt that one down. 
All right, so let's let's grab up. Uh, where can we grab up some more? There we go. Eight aspen logs, and I grabbed tons of wood. So don't worry, guys. We have we have plenty of wood. All right, so we do that, and then hopefully we first try. Come on, first try. First try. First try. You motherfuck. <laughs> All right, so that didn't work. Fail well. Fail well. Uh, two of them. We'll, we'll, we'll do this. Then we'll do that. Bam. Bam. All right. We're going to just go ahead and let you. Mother. Maybe we need to get away. Come on. Is it windy outside? Oh, come on. Here we, we'll cover it. Yeah, wind's blowing. Let's just cover over here. Oh, yeah. All right. We got, we got it going. We got it going. <laughs> All right. So now, hopefully. Here, we'll just toss you in there. <laughs> oh fuck! All right, well now we know that's definitely not going anywhere. Uh, how are you doing over here, sir? So we we got some tannin. Good job, good job tannin. We got some uh some leather. Good job, soaked leather. Now we grab this, put a knife under it, next to it, on top of it, somewhere around it. <laughs> what the fuck, sir? I'm pretty sure this is how you do it. Right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, so soaked. Doesn't this have to get scraped? Fucking change it on me one more time. All right, so apparently we need a log. Bam. Grab your leather. How the fuck do you do this? Not like that, apparently. Okay, so you, I don't know how you make this or if this is how you do it, but it's kind of like, you know how um, when you put down a rock one of these little smooth stone things and you right click on it with a knife how it does that little food prep area on the top well this should be the same so you should be able to place down it says place down a log i'm, I'm reading the wiki well not right now right now but I, I read it from a wiki so it says you do that and then you place this oh there we go okay so that is how you do it that's pretty cool all right and then second step you grab your knife and you just do this hmm and so what we're doing, um, it's called scraping the leather. <laughs> yes, that's literally it. Um, but what you're doing is you're basically removing all the fibers from the um, skin of the cow or the deer, whatever you killed, right? And then when you do that, what happens is you're basically removing a lot of like the bacteria and shit that will make it rot. Because you got to remember, this is the skin of an animal. <laughs> so if you ever wondered where leather came from, there you go. It's actually the skin of an animal. Um, so in order for it not to rot and smell like shit, you got to scrape off all the nasty nastiness that is on the leather. And then uh, what you end up with is this stuff, which is medium scraped hides. So let me let me finish doing this, and then I will. Sh oh, are you trying to donate some hides? Yeah, just donate some hides there, sir. Okay, just take a seat. We'll be right with you. Don't you worry. I th I think this is actually your nephew, right? If I'm not mistaken. <laughs> oh yeah, get upset. He's all kinds of mad. <laughs> is you mad? All right, I, th I think this is your brother right here. Yeah, right, right. Is it look about right. Oh shit, son. No. Oh, oh you're crying now. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> I think he might be a little bit mad, guys. You guys think he's mad? Here, you know what? I've had enough of your shit, sir. Don't worry. I'm not. I'm, I, won't, I won't go outside. What'd you drop? What did you drop? I saw you drop something. What is that? More? Okay, I'll take it. Some more brass sheets. And some more meef. Yeah, that guy's been chilling there the whole time. Ever since you guys left, he's been down there this whole time. We're gonna probably have to name him. We'll make we'll make a little name tag for him. Uh, what, what? Okay, do we? Oh, we needed a knife. That's what I came here for. I'm like. Oh, we got more pants. <laughs> we got more pants. I think I have another pair of pants up here. Yeah, that one's pretty much full. So that one's almost full too. All right, so let's see. Where, where is my knife collection? I have a nice knife collection. Um, I'll use my karambit faded one. Yes. Oh, it is. <laughs> this one's pretty fucked up too. Oh, shit, son. Uh, where, where's my leather? Oh, are you still over here? Oh, you're still over here. All right. We will take it. So I'm just going to go ahead and finish this guy up and then we can go toss all these guys into the same barrel because the fucked up part is you can't open up the barrel once it's sealed, it's sealed. 
So that means you got to get it right the first time. If you don't, then you're kind of screwed. All right, so now we have all five of these guys. These are all nice little medium prepared hides. So we're just going to go toss these bad boys inside some fresh water, I think. Is, you, is that the next one? Yeah. Okay, so now it's going to go from scraped leather to medium prepared leather hide. So that's going to do its thing. Uh, this one. Oh, apparently we have some sugar now. Nice. Very nice. Can we eat this? Oh, we can. Sweet. Hold on. Hold on. Look at the, look at how my sandwich collection. I didn't know how many sandwiches you could actually make out of here. So I've, I've basically just been stocking up on sandwiches just in case we weren't able to make any more. Cause I was like, all right, if I'm going to make this move, I'm going to need me some sandwiches. <laughs> you can't make sandwiches without, there we go. Oh shit. That's not what I was trying to do. But, um, yeah. So if you put a bowl in there and you do that, you can actually create salads as well. So should we do a, a sushi salad? That's what it looks like. Well, it's actually it's cooked fish, so it wouldn't really be sushi. It'd be more of like a cooked warm poke salad. Yeah. But I'm pretty sure this is really cold by now though. All right, so we're gonna keep that. We'll, we'll just keep that with us. Uh, Meat will go back inside here. I think that's where we're keeping it for now. Uh, we'll grab that and place this bad boy inside here. Oh no. I think we're running out of room here, guys. We're running out of room. And I think we're running out of time, too. All right, here, look. Is he going to be done? I'm going to try to show you guys this. Oh, this should be done here pretty soon. <gasps> Come on, everybody. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. We got to do this. Oh, fuck. Fuck. If this doesn't work, then we're screwed because we just wasted more time. Nope, that didn't work. Ah, fucking sucks. Oh, so the plan B... And 140 units of bismuth. Now, the only problem with that is we don't have a mold for this. Fuck me, sir. And that's going to cool down before we're able to use it. So, I guess what we could do is grab ourselves one of these guys. So, we're probably going to get our first pick, right? Yeah, we'll, go, we'll grab a pick. Why not? That's probably a good idea. Because we're going to need the pick anyways. Can we not do that? Is that not a thing? Can you not make yourself a bismuth? Damn it. Biz how do you how do you spell that? <laughs> Alright, let's see. B S M U T H. Alright, so yeah you can. What is that then? That is a bit oh, you gotta make the bronze. Damn it! Damn it to hell. Alright, so I knew you could get the bismuth. I just totally forgot that you can't just make bismuth. See, we get that, and you got to mix that with some copper, and then you got to mix that with some zinc, which we have. We have all of these guys right there. Uh, can we toss a copper and get in there? <laughs> Damn it. Oh, Jeebus. Yeah, it's not going to work. All right, well, I guess we're just going to have to pull it out. Well, good thing we had those, though. At least we had those. So we might not actually have enough. Yeah. Yeah. We don't have enough, guys. <laughs> we don't have enough. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm going to place this down. I'm going to lick my wounds. <laughs> and then uh, we're, we're probably going to call it a wrap here, guys, because uh, plans did not go as planned today. <laughs> but, hey, at least you guys got to see and check out how to make some leather stuff. So we'll pretend that that was the original plan. Yeah. How'd you guys enjoy learning how to make yourself some leather, huh? Mm, pretty amazing, huh? Pretty amazing. So next episode, I think we're going to use that leather for a little uh, quiver, quiver friend, I think. Is that is that what you guys were telling me? A little quiver friend over here. So we just need that leather right there. And then we'll be able to nap us some leather. Um, and this is pretty simple. I'll show you guys how to do that. You just need a knife, I think. And then just get yourself a little quiver thing. And I'll show you guys what that's good for. But uh, until then, guys, till then, hopefully, hope, hopefully you guys did enjoy this derpy little episode. Uh, I, I know it didn't go as planned, but uh, we did get some stuff done. Hmm? Right? Right? Um, so I guess it counts for something. But um, yeah, guys, that's going to do it. So uh, if you're new to my channel and you want to catch yourself uh, next episode, a Terraforma Punk 2, or any other derpy ass my Minecraft stuff that we do on this channel, why don't you head on down there and hit that subscribe button because uh, it's the only way you get notified when I post our next episode. But guys, guys, that does it for me. I'm Dizzy Aaron, and I am out.